we know is what we're told to think and who we are told to be. But the American dream is different for everyone. Students come to us from all walks of life with a passion for the trades, the backbone of America. So we established a brand that makes the American dream yours. Know your brand, forge your path. Take hold of your future with WyoTech. JD, why are we running so late? Troy never told me what time we were doing this webinar. I mean, I don't even understand why he's in charge anyways. I mean, he's, he's a little different. Come on, Troy, get a hold of yourself. We've got a webinar to do. You are awesome. You are going to give the greatest webinar of all time. He changes his shirts like five times throughout the day. He's a diva. JD, he's the vice president of marketing. He can wear what he wants. It's weird. Oxyacetylene, oxyacetylene, high performance power trains, fabrication, fabrication. Hello? I'm getting ready to give this webinar yeah, in a mask. I mean, I don't know how I'm supposed to do this. My glasses are fogging up. I can't read a thing. I don't think. You can't get COVID through the internet. It's not that kind of virus. COVID can't be transmitted through Zoom? <laughs> That's a relief, golly. Hey, thanks a lot. That's a great tip. Oh, are we rolling? Unbelievable. This is who you put in charge. Let him get through the webinar and we'll see how he does. Hey guys, it's Troy coming to you live from WyoTech here in Laramie, Wyoming. We are thrilled that you've chosen to take time out of your virtual learning day in order to connect with us and learn about our school and the industry as a whole. So what we're going to do is we're going to take a real quick overview of WyoTech. We're going to start by telling you about our core programs. And the first one of the core programs that I'm going to tell you about is collision and refinishing. So I'm gonna queue up a little bit of a video here and then we'll circle back. We'll talk a little bit about the specifics about the program. Thanks again for being here. In the collision program, you are gonna learn basic body repair. Whether that's taking a panel off and just putting it back on without making any more work for yourself or actually welding on or sectioning in panels to do a major collision repair. Some of the key skills you're gonna learn, besides just the body repair, is gonna be welding. You're gonna spend three days straight, eight hours a day welding. We'll have you do all types of welds, whether it's butt with backing, plug welds, lap welds. We're gonna cover all the types of welds that are done on today's vehicle. I think the coolest thing about this program is it leads through so many pathways. You can go into a collision shop, to a restoration shop, you can go into a full customization shop with the skills we're teaching you in the Collision Refinishing Program. So what we're gonna do now is cover a little bit of detail. The slides you see on screen will actually give you some of the main things that you learn. Like all of our core programs here at WyoTech, Collision and Refinishing is broken into four six-week phases. Those phases are Collision 1, Collision 2, Refinishing 1, and Refinishing 2. And during that, you're gonna learn all kinds of cool stuff like MIG welding for aluminum and steel. You're gonna learn paint matching, paint mixing, color theory, trim repair. The folks in Collision, there's a little bit more of an artistic angle to it. So if you're someone that enjoys working with your hands, but you've got that artistic background, this program gives you an avenue in which to really uh, take advantage of that creativity. With this program, you can do a variety of things. One would be work in a body shop. Well, what does that mean? Well, when you get in a fender bender, and we've probably all done that, an insurance estimator comes out, takes a look at the damage, and then you take it into a body shop in order to get repaired. That's one avenue that's available to students who complete this program. And you might end up working for a big company like an Abra or a Caliber Collision that has locations all over the country, or it might be a small independent shop, all kinds of opportunity. But beyond body shops, there's a lot of opportunity and a lot of avenues available to our graduates, like investigative crash scene people, for instance, people who have collision backgrounds. What those people do is when there's automobile accidents, and there might be a court case pending, they go out, take a look at the actual vehicle, determine whether or not it's ever been in an accident before, and then they figure out whether or not that damage was repaired correctly, and if it wasn't repaired correctly, whether or not that contributed to the accident or 
the damages resulting in that accident. So the field is really quite wide and full of opportunity. So the second of our core programs is our automotive program. And, well, hey, Jadine, nice of you to show up. Hi, Troy. It'd been nice if somebody would have told me what time we needed to be here this morning. Uh, Jim was rushing to get me here as fast as he could. Couldn't sleep anymore? Thought you'd come into work? <laughs> Let's just show him the automotive well, video. I'm glad you're here now. Hey, thank you. In the automotive program, you're gonna have the opportunity to become a great mechanic. The classes in automotive are engine management systems, drivabilities and diagnostics, chassis, and drivetrain. You'll have the opportunities to understand the components of an engine, the cooling, the lubrication, common problems, troubleshooting. You're gonna learn how to work on a vehicle, one end to the other. If you're a mechanic in the automotive industry, it's going to open up a lot of different doors for you. It could lead to working for an independent owner, you can go into a dealership, you can also become a trainer in the industry, or you can open up your own facility. I think one of the most exciting things about the automotive program is that you can fix things yourself. Whether you're rebuilding a transmission, the front suspension, in the automotive program, you're going to be able to develop a passion for what you love. So real quick, to recap our automotive program, like all of our core programs, it's six months in length and it's broken into four different six-week phases. In the case of automotive, we're dealing with engine management systems, drivability diagnostics, drivetrains, and then chassis. So you can see on the slides what all you cover in each one of those phases. But again, let's talk about what you can do after you complete this program. Obviously, the automotive industry is huge. It accounts for many, many, many jobs in the United States. And right now, there's a huge demand for technicians. So whether it's at a dealership like Audi, Range Rover, Chevy, Ford, the list goes on and on. All of those dealerships have service departments, and then there's also a wide variety of independent shops that work on all makes and models of vehicles. So the automotive industry is full of fantastic opportunity, and it's a very stable industry as well, as we've seen recently during COVID. All right, guys, let's talk about our diesel program. Did you just change your shirt? Yes, as a matter of fact, I did. My stylist likes me to keep my wardrobe fresh. I only brought one change of clothes to this. I see that. And the cool thing is that you could go straight to a funeral and it'll fit right in. Maybe your funeral. Why don't we just roll with the diesel video? I, I agree. Let's just talk about diesel. Some of the classes you'll be taking in our diesel program are EMS and R, which is engine management systems and refrigeration, our engines program, FP&E, which is fluid power and electrical, and then our powertrains program. We have all types of engines and students that are gonna get their hands on every one of them. They'll also get their hands on some transmissions. We have trucks out there, they will pull transmissions out and put them back in. So they're gonna take an Eaton 13 speed, tear it all the way apart and put it back together. The opportunities coming out of our diesel program aren't just in the automotive industry. Tractors, off-road equipment, construction, gen sets, trains, you can work on ships. Coming out of our diesel program, you will have the confidence to go out into the industry and have a very good working knowledge of electronics, hydraulics, refrigeration, how to tear an engine apart, put it back together, how to diagnose it, how to work with all the components on a diesel truck. The last of our three core programs is our diesel program. And the four phases of diesel are gonna be fluid power and electrical, engines, engine management systems and refrigeration, and powertrains. Let's talk about the diesel industry. A lot of people think about over the road trucking, which is certainly important. Some of the things we don't think about, construction equipment, mining, energy. If you think about the hospital, what happens at a hospital if the power goes down? There's these huge generators that fire up that keep all the life support systems and everything moving. Those run on diesel. So diesel has all these offshoots. There's a ton of opportunity in literally almost every industry because diesel is so widely used. And right now the need for diesel technicians is unprecedented. 
So there's a lot of fantastic opportunity for young people that come here and complete this core program. So next, we're gonna talk about our specialty programs. That's a nice shirt. Do you wear it to church? I do not wear it to church. It's Bohemian Western. What do you think? It's real nice. One of the things that makes WyoTech unique is that you can complete your program in as little as nine months. So when you're thinking about what you'd want to do here at WyoTech, our students initially, they pick one of our core programs. So either automotive, diesel, or collision refinishing. And then they pick one of the specialty programs, which lasts three months. And those nine months make up your base program. You can stay and take more but that's how we start, is you pick a six month core plus a three month specialty program and that makes up your base program. And we're gonna talk about those here next. Here at WildTech, we have six specialty programs. Advanced Diesel, Street Rod, Motorsports Chassis Fabrication, Trim and Upholstery, HPPT, which is High Performance Powertrains. We also have our ASM, which is Applied Service Management, which is our business portion that you can get an AOS out of. As you go through the advanced diesel program, we bring in customer vehicles off the road and you are going to learn how to inspect and diagnose any problems that could be going on with that truck and actually get real hands-on experience. So the doors that are gonna open through the advanced diesel program are gonna lead you to be either a heavy equipment technician, an over the road technician, whether you're doing that on site, whether you're in your own service truck, or whether you're working in a dealership. As you go through our trim and upholstery program, you're gonna learn all about the interior of a vehicle. You're gonna also learn how to do convertible tops, vinyl tops, custom upholstery, whether you're working on planes, trains, automobiles, or open up your own custom trim and upholstery shop, the opportunity is out there for you to succeed. As you go through our street ride program here at WildTech, the different things you'll be doing in there is anywhere from metal shaping to custom paint work. Some of the opportunities coming out of the street rod program could be going into a body shop that specializes in custom metal fabrication work, custom paint work, or it could be as simple as doing some custom welding. Whether it's aircraft, working with aluminum, working with steel, those opportunities are out there for you to be successful. So in motorsports chassis fabrication, you're gonna go through and learn about frame design. You're gonna learn the tools of the trade in here as well, whether you're using a bridge port, whether you're using a lathe, MIG welding, TIG welding. The opportunities after coming out of our motorsports chassis fabrication program, you can go to a customizing shop, whether it's a truck shop, a car shop, drag racing, whether you're going off-road, going through this program will help you achieve your goals no matter which pathway you choose in the industry. As you take our Applied Service Management program, this program is designed around the business piece of the industry. Through this program, you'll achieve an Associates of Occupational Studies degree. Whether you're a service technician in a truck shop or a dealership or a body shop manager, the students that finish ASM are better set up for management. As you go through our HPPT program, this program is designed for performance. When a student comes through our program, they would like the opportunity to work on a race team. Their grandeur coming out of this is, I'm gonna come out here understanding what it takes to put a blower on a car or a supercharger on a car or nitrous on a car. To achieve that, they have to have a better understanding of the components they're putting on the engine because coming in second is no fun, but the journey to get to number one is always a good time. So guys, as you saw, we have six different specialty programs. Each one of our specialty programs lasts three months. Applied Service Management is basically a business management course. So you learn basic principles like OSHA regs, accounting, uh, advertising, marketing, all that kind of stuff that's involved in running a business. So it's a really super program if you have aspirations of maybe owning your own shop, or perhaps if you're in a dealership setting, you want to advance and become like a service rider. It also comes with an associate's degree. So you can complete an associate's degree by putting this specialty program with your core and finish an associate's degree in nine months, which is awesome. The second one we want to take a look at is our advanced diesel program. We actually bring in working cabs for over the road trucks and they come in from companies like Penske and other leasing companies. 
and they go through it bumper to bumper. And by the time they're finished, it actually leaves as a Department of Transportation certified vehicle. So you're working on class eight tractors and you're doing exactly what you would do when you go out in the field. So this is a very popular program for our diesel employers. They love the students that come out of this program because they have a fantastic background doing exactly what they're hiring them to do. The next one is high performance powertrains. This entire program is about making things go fast. It's about more power. It really doesn't matter what you're into, whether it's the old muscle cars with the carbureted engines or the electronically fuel injected engines on these newer vehicles. The principles you learn in this program apply to both. So a really cool program, really popular one. We've got three dynos in this program. We've got a rack dyno, we've got an in-ground dyno, and then we've got an engine stand dyno. Like everything here at WyoTech, the equipment's excellent, it's up to date, and we've got quite a bit of it. The next one we're going to talk about is motorsports chassis fabrication. Something really cool about this program is you are learning math and engineering. Something you may not really think about when it comes to chassis, however, we're talking about frame design and modification. So you're designing the chassis. And a lot of times people, they don't like math, but if they can apply it to something that they're interested in, the math component is super easy. This class is heavy on welding. Okay, now we do it in the context of like building tube frames, modifying suspensions, all that kind of stuff. But the truth is those welding skills that you learn in that class, they're applicable a variety of different places, not just inside the chassis fabrication industry. The next specialty program we're gonna talk about is street rod and custom fabrication. This class is built around working with metal, specifically metal shaping. So. You can take a flat piece of metal and turn it into a fender for a vehicle or maybe a gas tank for a motorcycle. In this class, you do MIG welding, TIG welding, oxyacetylene welding, and you also learn custom paint, which is super cool. So we've got this awesome instructor here. His name is Mike. You can check him out on YouTube, actually. But if you've ever seen Bob Ross, he's kind of like the Bob Ross of uh, automotive painting. But he teaches our students all these specialty paint techniques like flip-flops, metallics, airbrushing, all that kind of stuff. And that's part of this course. And just like with chassis fab, the skills you learn in here can be used to go a variety of different directions. It doesn't have to be utilized only in the street rod industry. Don't you think, Judy? Absolutely. And the one thing I do want to say about street rod, especially for our students, they get the opportunity to work with tools you can't find anywhere else. So I just think it's an awesome opportunity for our students to get their hands on that kind of equipment. There's also a great YouTube video of Randy, one of our instructors over there, making a flat piece of metal a bowl. So if you have some time, go check out our YouTube channel. There's some great videos on there. So I think we'll move on to the last one. This is actually my favorite program. It's trim and upholstery. There aren't a lot of schools that teach this type of thing. We're fortunate in that we have a gentleman that runs this program named Mac. His family has been in the trim and upholstery business for years and years and years. So when you think about a vehicle in the interior, you've got door panels, you've got headliners, you've got the dashboard, you've got the seats, other interior components. You learn to do all that stuff in trim and upholstery. This is a fantastic program. These skills are applicable not only with vehicles, but with boats, trailers, RVs, and even furniture in your house, as a matter of fact. You bet. Yeah, so all kinds of avenues you can take this training and take it as well. If you're wanting to start a business, that is probably one of the cheapest uh, businesses you can start, which we've had some students do that quite often. A few thousand dollars, you can get your own business started. And that's pretty rare. And you yeah. could start making your own cool shirts if you wanted. Nobody makes shirts this cool, not in trim and upholstery. <laughs> I think we'll transition and talk about Laramie and where we're located. Okay. This is my favorite part. I'm a Laramie native and I'm really excited to show you this next video. Students come from all over America. We have kids from Maine, California, Texas. They love it here. My name is Braden Aletto. I am from Chico, California. My first impression of Laramie when I got here is I loved it. It is a whole different environment. And the whole community is so close and so tight. Like you'll walk down the street, somebody will wave hi to you, and you're like, oh wow, like that's that's different. 
My name is Chase Ackerman from Spokane, Washington. When I first came to Laramie, it was exciting. How you can go from open ranges to such unique mountains, it, it takes your breath away. My name is Micah Hager. I'm from Michigan. It's great to get outside and see some of the most beautiful scenery in the world. Living in Laramie, most of the things that we do include the outdoors. Wyoming is mountains and lakes and rivers, and that would include Yellowstone National Park, the Tetons. A lot of the students love exploring the snowy range, great hiking, skiing in the winter, snowboarding, whatever you like to do. My name is Hannah Stout. I'm from Sterling, Illinois. There's so much more to Wyotech, so many more experiences, friends you can make. There's never any shortage of like actual activities to do. Wyotech is always doing events. Some of those ways that trade school is kind of compared to four-year colleges. We have a student life. We still have dorms. We have events to make them get involved with the community, have some fun, including car cruises, car shows. We work with the local rec center in Laramie to get them a free gym membership, courtesy of WyoTech. We want to go to the rec center, do some volleyball, basketball tournaments. We make a community out of our college and we try to get these kids to make lifelong friendships, kind of just interact with people that are going to go into the same field as them so they have a good support system when they get out of here. My name is Jonathan, I'm from Wright, Wyoming. I'm opening up to having more friends has made a positive change in my life because like, I wouldn't talk to anybody. Going to school here, my people skills have gotten a lot better. Some ways that we've helped them transition from high school to adulthood would be things such as workshops, how to cook. We have life skill packets for like conflict management, time management, financial management, things that are gonna help them succeed in the real world. It was, it's a long way from home for me. It was definitely a little bit scary coming out here, but once I got out here and just met some amazing people and really the best experience ever. If you just think, well, maybe I want to go to Wild Tech, don't let the distance be a thing that holds you back because it's a great place. There's great people here that will help you out, you know? So just don't let that be an inhibitor to coming to school here because it's a great opportunity. Definitely apply yourself, do good work, and people start to notice, and you get recommendations for jobs. That's what got my boss to hire me in the first place. So apply yourself and you work hard and you prove yourself. These companies will take notice and endless opportunities, like absolutely endless. Laramie's amazing, and we're big believers here that just because you want to pursue a skilled trade in your training, it doesn't mean you should have to sacrifice your college experience, right? So to that end, we've gone out of our way to create a true campus environment. There's tons of stuff to do around here. We also have our own on-campus housing. So it's literally a three minute walk to class. The housing is a huge advantage and it's something that we're super proud of because it's a benefit that really schools that do the type of training we do, they typically don't have housing for their students but we believe that that's a vital part of the college experience. There's been a lot of publicity recently about the value of a college education. Obviously, we all know that the cost of education is skyrocketing, and a lot of people are really trying to figure out whether or not it's even worth it anymore, particularly when you talk about a traditional four-year degree, right? So we're super proud of our tuition here at Wyotech. It's a tremendous value. We did talk about the nine month core program. The tuition associated with that is $29,000. That includes all the tools you need to complete the class. It includes your text materials, access to the online portal, your uniform shirts. So basically there's not all these extra fees and things associated with it. That's the price, right? The only other thing there is, there's a tool deposit. And as long as your tools come back at the end of the class, you'll get that back. In addition to tuition, we've got to think about living expenses while you're here in Laramie. We tell everybody that all in, when you think about your living expenses, rent, tuition, all that good stuff, you're probably looking at thirty-five to $36,000 for your nine month program, okay? So super simple, that's an all in price. We encourage families to think about something called opportunity costs, right? And simply put what that is, Let's compare it to a community college. You might be able to get an automotive 
a certificate or degree at a community college, it's probably going to take you about two years, right? So at WyoTech, you could complete your program in nine months because of our format and you'd actually graduate sooner. So you would be potentially able to work for 15 months and earn a wage in the time that you would still be attending class at the community college and not have the opportunity to earn a wage. And if you think about a four-year school, I mean, my goodness, you could be out working over three years and earning money in the time you'd still be sitting in class. So that opportunity cost is an important thing to consider. Even so, no matter how great a value it is, I mean, it's still a substantial amount of money. And important to note, we participate in federal financial aid programs. So just like if you were to go to school at a state school, the same exact programs are available to our students and their families here. Now, Troy talked to you about value. I want to talk to you about our career services team. We make sure each one of our students has a resume on file. We work with them on interviewing. So employers come from all over the country to interview our students. A lot of our students have the opportunity to land a job offer before they even graduate school. So I think that's a really great service that WyoTech provides. And then if you think about our career fairs, our last one we had before COVID set in and all the travel restrictions set in, I think we had over 50 employers here on campus. They conducted over 500 interviews and I think several students had multiple job offers as a result of that. So we really take a lot of pride in not only making sure that they get great training, but that we help them with that transition over to a career afterwards. That's unique. A lot of universities, colleges, they don't help you in that way. So that is one thing that sets us apart and, and uh, it's a super big benefit. Alrighty, so now that we have talked to you about all things WyoTech, let's talk about you and what your next steps are if you are interested in joining the WyoTech family. If you've watched this and something struck a chord, you're like, man, that seems really cool. I wanna check that out. Do it, okay? There's all kinds of people tugging at you right now, telling you what you need to do, what you should do. You need to go take this test, that test. You need to go get this degree, that degree. None of that matters. The only thing that matters is what's gonna make you happy. And if this seemed like something that you wanted to look into, you can either scan that QR code or click that link that's on the screen and just fill out your information and tell us about which programs seem most interesting to you. What'll happen then is one of our admissions team is gonna reach out to you. Could be somebody that's in your area, could be somebody here at campus, but we'll just call up and have a conversation. If it makes sense at that point to set up a time to meet with you and your parents, we'll go ahead and do that. Those appointments usually take an hour, maybe an hour and a half. If you spend that time and it ends up being not a good match, no problem, at least you know. But if it does end up being a match, that could be 90 of the best minutes you've ever spent in your life because several people have come here to WyoTech and it has literally changed the trajectory of their life. And it can do that for you too. You come here, put in the time and the hard work, we'll furnish the skills and the guidance and together that's a winning combination. So we wish you the best of luck in the rest of the high school year, whatever that happens to look like. And we'll look forward to seeing a lot of you here at WyoTech, and we'll talk with a lot of you soon. Take care. Thanks for being here. And make sure you check us out on social media. We post a lot of fun things going on at the school. It's a good way to connect and stay up to date. Thank you.